の横浜市内ですが大きく揺れておりますやばいやばい
story now. Researchers are working to understand what's killing off starfish along the west coast and most recently here in Oregon. KVAL's Angelica Curio has the story. In recent weeks, sea stars along the Oregon coast have started to look a lot like this and die off. And what's worse, no one seems to know what's causing it. It's called sea star wasting syndrome, an epidemic that up until now hadn't been seen in Oregon. But take a look at this. These two pictures were taken just two weeks apart. A wall now left bare by sea stars wasting away. If you see sea stars that are losing arms, that is, that is pretty much the last stages of, of sea star wasting syndrome. Researchers have been collecting samples along the coast, trying to figure out what's causing it. Experts say it could be an environmental stressor like salt levels in the water or temperature. It doesn't seem like it's going to be one thing. It seems like it's probably a, a multiple factor. Miner says right now about 20 different star species seem to be affected by this disease. As far as human effects, I wouldn't expect there's any and, and nobody's being concerned about that at this point. Experts say historically there have been similar cases along the coast and the species seem to have recovered. But for now, only time will tell. Reporting in Coos Bay, I'm in Helica Carrillo. Starfish, also known as sea stars, are wasting away by the tens of thousands. Not just in Puget Sound, but up and down North America's Pacific coast. And nobody knows why. I've been diving out here for almost 24 years and people always ask me, do you see any big difference between you know, now and, and when you started. And I've seen some subtle differences, but this is the change of my lifetime.